Accessing your home router from within the network is a straightforward process, simply connect to the network and enter your router's IP address in the web browser. However, if you're interested in accessing your router remotely from outside your network, this video will guide you on how to achieve that for your TP-Link router, allowing access from anywhere over the internet. By default, the remote management feature is turned off as a security measure. To enable it, you need to log into the router's admin panel. Navigate to the security tab on the left and click on remote management. If the remote management function is disabled, you'll see the default port 80 and the IP address 0.0.0.0. .0 .0 .0. You can either keep the default web management port, which is 80 or 8080, or choose another port number if necessary. In the remote management IP address field, entering 255.255.255.255 allows remote access from anywhere, but this poses a security risk. It's advisable to specify the IP address of a particular network from which you intend to access the router. For example, if you want to access your TP-Link router from a specific network, enter the public IP of that network. To find the public IP, open a browser and search for what is my IP. Once you have the IP address, input it in the designated field. To connect to the router from an external network, note down the WAN IP address of the router. Then, in a web browser, enter your router's WAN IP address followed by the port number you set. On the login page, enter the router's password, and you should gain access to the admin panel. It's crucial to be aware that remote management can pose security risks. To mitigate these risks, use a robust login password and disable the feature when not in use.